A potential medical breakthrough for people suffering from fatty liver disease. A clinical trial at a Jacksonville Research Center is showing very promising results. News for Jack supporter Eric Avenue joins us now live to explain. Kent, that medical breakthrough comes in the form of a pill that is designed to uh, specifically imitate a thyroid hormone that only works to get rid of fat in the liver. And according to researchers, the treatments are working without harmful side effects. This new drug called Rosmeteram is now a medical breakthrough that researchers across the U.S. and here at the Jacksonville Center for Clinical Research say could reverse the effects of fatty liver disease and prevent people from needing a life-saving liver transplant operation. This study result... On a drug Center director Dr. Michael Corrin says the company that makes the drug came up with the idea of targeting a hormone produced in the thyroid to rid the liver of excessive fat. And they said, okay, well, how about if the value of the thyroid hormone in the liver is something distinct from what thyroid hormone does to other parts of the body. So they came up with this idea of creating this thyroid hormone mimetic that only works in helping the liver get rid of fat. Clinical trials of the drug here in Jacksonville and at clinical research centers across the U.S. involving more than a thousand patients with fatty liver disease prove the strategy works. Doctors say the disease is very common with more than a quarter of the U.S. population having it. Fatty liver disease goes together with obesity and higher levels of bad cholesterol. As the liver is responsible for removing these things from the body and you can overwhelm the liver. But what happens is that when you get fatty liver, it could progress to further stages. First, it's an inflammatory stage, and then it becomes fibrosis, where you actually have scarring. And then finally, you develop cirrhosis, where the liver stops working. When that happens, a person needs a liver transplant operation to survive. Dr. Corrin says fatty liver disease has become the number one reason for liver transplant referrals. But this new drug that is showing major success in clinical trials could significantly reduce the number of those costly operations that run in the hundreds of thousands of dollars. That's our goal, is hope that we can really change that quite a bit. So drugs came out, oh, maybe about 20 years ago, that completely got rid of hepatitis C as a problem. And hepatitis C prior to that was a big source of people developing end-stage liver disease, cirrhosis, and then ultimately needing a liver transplant. The goal for fatty liver is the same. Although some people have a genetic predisposition to developing fatty liver disease, Dr. Corrin says an overwhelming majority of patients develop the condition due to a lifestyle of unhealthy eating and not exercising. It's a condition that develops over a long period of time, and even with the use of this new medication, it may still take some time to reverse. An interesting, an interesting point here is that uh, resmeteram is showing so much promise that the company that makes it, uh, the their stocks have quadrupled within the past 48 hours. Reporting live, Eric Avignet, Channel 4, The Local Station.